A man of courage and conviction. That's how many are remembering Dallas's first black district attorney, Craig Watkins. After his death last week, our Steve Pickett has the tributes today at Watkins Funeral Service. But if the storms, if they don't cease. A native son for the city of Dallas, who rose to the county's chief law enforcement position for criminal justice. Mayor Eric Johnson, current district attorney John Crusoe, hundreds filling Oak Cliff's Concord Missionary Church to salute former district attorney Craig Watkins. He became not only the first African-American district attorney in the history of Dallas County, but the entire state of Texas. Craig believed, John Crusoe, that the job of a prosecutor is not to prosecute, but to see that justice is done. And he had the courage to do what he knew God had placed them here to do. Watkins' office put plenty in prison, but his national prominence came from the Dallas court hearings freeing more than two dozen men from wrongful convictions, men in prison for decades, until Watkins' office fought for them. Ten of those men attending today's funeral. Craig Watkins returned to private practice in 2016 here at his office in South Dallas after losing a re-election bid. But diversity at the DA's office has never looked brighter since the day he took office. Two more black DAs have led Dallas County's Criminal Justice Division. In today's farewell service, Watkins was noted for what one lawyer called the mission of prosecuting cases, not persecuting people. In Dallas, Steve Pickett, CBS News, Texas.